Have you ever looked up at the sky and watched the sunset or the sunrise? Seeing all the beautiful colors? Well, here's a look that was inspired by the sunrise in Impressionist paintings, and I will show you how to achieve this look. Let's get started. Make sure you have foundation all blended onto your skin and finishing powder to make it last all day. Next, I will use eye primer to prime the eyes and blend away onto the skin. The benefit of this is so that the eyeshadow can appear more vibrant and it will last longer. Next, with the palette I'm using by M by Michelle Phan, I'm going to pick up a peachy color and apply it all over the eyes as base. I want to give my eyes some sort of a undertone warmth to the eyes. With the palette I received from my Ipsy Glam bag of March, I'll be picking the light brown and I'm going to apply it on my lids. To me personally, by using my fingers, I can pick up the product more. Just make sure your fingers are clean. Next, pick up a white or a pearlish eyeshadow and apply it in the inner corner of your eyes. This is optional. You can splash a bit of a gold eyeshadow on one section of the lid to give more of a warmer feel to it. Next, pick up the golden brownish color from the palette and apply it on the outer corner of the crease area. Follow your crease and keep adding on the pigment until you are satisfied. Next, I'm picking up the blue from the same palette and apply it just above the crease but not hitting the brow bone. And shape it in a way that looks like a wing. So just wing it. Don't forget to wear the blue on the bottom lashes. You want to create balance. Next, with a fluffy brush, blend the hard edges away. And this is optional. If you want to add more sparkle to your eyes, pat a little bit of glitter onto your eyes. Take a gel liner and a brush, line your eyes. It should be close to the lash line as possible. Next, I'm picking up this water liner in Amazing Gray by M. Michelle Phan, and I'm going to apply it on my waterline in the inner rims. To me, it looks like sparkling water. After that, mascara away. Now, finish it off with a rosy pink color. Dab it onto your lips. done a beautiful magical look that reminds you of a beautiful sunset that was inspired by impressionist sunset paintings okay I'm gonna stop this awkward posing so I hope you enjoyed this look take care and God bless bye